This is his first ever start against his former team. No surprise to see Johnny Hicks in the Bandits net. He was sensational last weekend in Black Falls with that season high 31 save performance in the Bandits 2-0 win. Our game is now underway and the Brooks Bandits begin their BCHL journey. Go though, the Bulldogs chip it out to center ice. And here comes Dimitriadis on a two on one with Hunter Brown. Dimitriadis to Brown! The deflection misses as Hicks comes across. Huey Hooker finds Parker Lalonde up the right side in the black fall zone. Lalonde to Huey who shoots forehand and Wilson Maxfield got just enough of it as it then slipped past him wide left of the black falls net. And we're back to five on five hockey. Kalen Fitzpatrick takes it away from Josh Sale. Enters with Logan Sawyer from the left circle shoots. Maxfield makes the stop. He commit. Tanner Willick behind the net for Eshra. Kalen Fitzpatrick throws a big check near the Black Falls bench on Dolan. Hopefully okay, but that was a hard body check from Fitzpatrick. Now Gilmore from the left circle. Shot got through scramble after Hicks made the save. Another chance from Hunter Brown. Snuck one on net. And Johnny Hicks with another stop. In front for Kalen Fitzpatrick, tied up. He recovers it and shoots, and got one through. Maxfield to save on the sharp angle try. He stays upright. Puck comes around the boards to the left side, and another big hit by Kalen Fitzpatrick, this time on the Bulldogs' leading scorer, Brendan Ross. He recovers it. Orangeville, Ontario native, Logan Sawyer at the blue line. Passes between the legs, Huey Hooker with open ice looking, high blocker, shoulder save by Wilson Maxfield. <laughs> Huey Hooker skates it out to center ice. Nice stick handling, leaves on the right wing for Nick Peluso. Back to Hunter Wallace who shoots off the side of the Black Falls net. Just yeah, missed the top corner on the blocker side. Here he comes again, up the left wing. Sawyer drops it in front for Josh! Trying to shoot against the grain and it misses. Puck comes to center ice for Parker Lalonde. Chips it ahead for Huey Hooker. Wallace in front, one timer, and Maxfield another save. As Huey and Hunter, the longtime friends, on the breakout. He's got an open winger, Parker Lalonde. Nice move around Ledrew. Goes through two defenders. He's going to draw a penalty as he shoots this in close, and Maxfield makes the stop. Also played in the BCHL last year with Powell River. This is Saucer over to Compton. Left hash for Budazoni. Lalonde turns and shoots. It was stopped, but then Nathan Free makes Bandits history. He scores! The first ever goal for the Brooks Bandits in the British Columbia Hockey League. It belongs to number 13, Nathan Free. One, nothing, Brooks. Nathan Free off the wall, passes to Logan Sawyer, gains the zone, drops it back for Free with open ice, who shoots? And Nathan Free scores! What a passing play, a give and go between Free and Sawyer. Nathan Free's got two in this period. Two, nothing, Brooks. 24th goal of the season, scored by number 13, Nathan Free. Estricht shoots from the blue line, shot got through and they score. Lost it on entry and then throws a hit at center ice on Brandis. Two on one now for Brooks. Lalonde carries ahead and shoots. Maxfield makes the stop and he'll bring it up to the blue line. Over to his left for Keith McKinnis. To shoot it on net, it was tipped. Maxfield, the tricky save that time with that redirected puck. Pucked off the shin pads of Ethan Beyer. Shot blocking machine out of Centennial, Colorado. Tanner Willick to Dakota McIntosh. One timer scores. So kind of like a Saskatchewan time zone yes. mentality. Okay. Here's Hooker now up the left side on his backhand. It redirects into the glove of Wilson Maxfield. That puck had movement though. I think it went off Tanner Willick. <laughs> See if we can watch a natural hat trick here. Two minutes to go in the second period. 2-2 game here comes Dolan. Toe drag shoots. Nice save from Johnny Hicks. Fights it off with the paddle. Maxfield watches it bounce into the corner. Tanner Willick takes a hit from Dylan Compton in the corner. Josh Weave cross ice to Nathan Free. Got around Brandis looking to complete the hat trick. 
as he goes one on O, oh, but Wilson Maxfield makes the glove save. The North Dakota commit, Keith McKinnis, lost it. Chance for Dolan, who takes it in. One timer, Johnny Hicks the stop. Budazoni at center ice. Took a hit, then Lalonde throws one on Jolly. Loose puck up for grabs. Lalonde to Peluso. It's poked away by Maxfield and the one Bulldog defenseman that was back. The Bandits recover it in the attacking zone. Luso under his stick. He'll take it off the wall. Go back to Hooker. Stick handling. Finds Mason who shoots from the slot. Maxfield to save. Rebound from Sawyer and Maxfield after it went off the side of the net and the glass dives on this puck for a whistle. Settled down by the Bulldogs and a big hit McCall on Knitting. And then Ty Mason finishes his check on Cody Willick. Kept to the outside, Sawyer and Budazoni were watching him, but the Bulldogs recover it. Jolly shoots, and Hicks makes the save. Parker Lalonde carries strongly into the black fault zone, shoots off the rush, Maxfield makes another stop. That's usually how a good line though, that's what makes out a good line up. Here's a one-timer from McIntosh off the post. Scary chance in front. Fitzpatrick enters right side, Ty Mason scores! Just after Dakota McIntosh hit a post, the Bandits take it the other way. Fitzpatrick to his fellow Saskatchewanian, Ty Mason, snipes the top shelf, 3-2 Brooks. Fitzpatrick back in that face-off circle. That, uh, the Bulldogs win the face-off. One-timer from Carter Corbier stopped by Johnny Hicks. Will that be enough? Bandits have it. Kalen Fitzpatrick takes it away. Time expires on the Black Falls Bulldogs. The Brooks Bandits' first ever win in the BCHL, a thriller. Ty Mason with the game-winning goal. Johnny Hicks, 24 saves. Nathan Free with two goals. Bandits win 3-2 in their BC debut.